Here is a multiple choice question on transformation of functions for you. You can pause the video, copy the question, answer and then look into my suggestions. Question is, graph of the function f of x is given below. So that's the graph of the function given. Write domain and range of transformed function g of x where g of x is equal to minus f of 2x minus 4 minus 1. Four choices are given to you. You can answer the question and then look into my solution. We should first factor 2 and then look into the transformation and thereafter get the domain and range. So let me rewrite g of x as equal to minus f of will factor 2 will get x minus 2 minus 1. Now that transformation indicates that there is a reflection on x-axis. The graph will be horizontally compressed by a factor of half translated 2 units right and 1 unit down. Now you can see as far as the domain is concerned the value of x is between minus 4 to plus 4 right so that is the domain of x in f of x so this is the domain in f of x what happens in g of x the value of x we have to half it and then move two units right that means we will actually multiply the center term by we will multiply these both these terms by half and then add two right so we could rewrite this as minus four times half and then we are going to add two this is for g of x domain right similarly on 4 we will do half of 4 and then add 2 so that becomes the domain so you could actually straight away write domain without even doing any transformations for the whole graph right so here you get minus 4 half is 2 minus which gives you 0 so as far as g of x domain is concerned we are doing domain first that will become between 0 and 4 right so you could straight away do the domain as I have done similarly we can calculate the range also in this fashion as far as the range is concerned let me write range now range here is between minus 4 to 2 right so the y value is actually between minus 4 and 2 including both of them however we have to multiply by a negative number and then take away 1 when you multiply by the negative number that is to say when you do this transformation with negative number then it becomes 4 the signs change and becomes like this this is taking care of reflection and now we are going to take care of translation which is minus 1 so if I take away 1 from here, I get 3, y value becomes take away 1 between minus 3 and 3, right? So which is y is greater than or equals to minus 3, less than or equals to 3. Doesn't make sense to you. So y is between minus 3 and 3 and g of x, x is between 0 to 4. So that is option C for us, right? So that is how you get your answer. So you can actually transform the extreme points as shown here I mean the limits domain and range itself and get your answer so I hope that makes sense 
Feel free to write your comments and share your views. If you like and subscribe to my videos, that'd be great. Thanks for watching and all the best.